I think we're here this time. Morning, it's Diana and my sweet husband Dean. We're going to talk a little bit about the oils. Um, lots of oils out there, a lot of people selling them. Lots of, got to be really careful. I've been hearing a lot of things about problems going wrong with um, animals, that kind of stuff. Be very careful where you get them. Um, why we oil, why I oil, supports um, was 11 major systems of the body, um, digestion, respiratory, muscular, Im immune system, your nervous system, cardiovascular, which is also actually your um, muscular, sorry, urinary, the integumentary is your skin, um, reproductive, lymphatic, and endocrine. We'll talk a little, probably not so much about, about that, but it really supports everything. Um, I have to show you quick on dog sitting, and she's Missing her human, little blind one, so she wants to stop crying, so I just hooked her on here. But I kind of drug you kicking and, kicking and screaming into this, didn't I? Yep. <laughs> so if you have any questions, post them. Um, otherwise, we're going to kind of talk about, um, basically, we're going to start with the oils a little bit. And um, I think mostly what you go have in the truck is the oils from the, the main the starter kit. Um, if we want to pull some of them over, we can talk about kind of how you use them. What's your favorite oil? Peppermint. Yeah. Peppermint and thieves. Yeah. Thieves every day. Um, four years ago, I got really sick. Got some infection in my lungs and stuff. Had broken ribs, coughing and stuff. Um, never smoked. Um, been around chemicals for 40 years, uh, farming stuff, so my lungs aren't the best. And if I go down the aisle in Walmart where all the detergents are, I start coughing and stuff. So it's, I, I get irritated really fast um, with different smells and stuff. So um, I've been on Thieves for three years, and... You could say knock on wood or whatever. Um, I haven't been sick. I've been sick a lot of years. I usually get bronchitis. Um, had it when I was young, and I, for some reason, get wore out in the winter time and get bronchitis. I haven't had it since four years ago. Um, been around a lot of people. I drive all over the United States and all over mm -hmm. Canada. I'm around sick people all the time in truck stops and stuff, and I thieves a lot. I I might overdo it, I don't know, um, but if I'm around somebody coughing or anything, I'm back in the truck putting thieves on. Um, I just put a dab on my on my hand and I lick it, and I do have a, a small spray bottle that I spray once in a while in my uh, in my in my mouth and stuff but um i sleep pretty much uh two weeks week and a half out on the road in a sleeper um i use a lot of uh peppermint um it's kind of dusty in the sleeper and stuff like that and and um if i put a little peppermint i usually just put it on my mustache so I breathe it all night, and it keeps my sinuses clean and stuff. Um, I use purification on my pillows and on my blankets. I have a, um, a small diffuser that plugs in a cigarette lighter that I'll diffuse either peppermint or um, uh, what did I just say? Purification, Purification yeah. um, stuff like that. I'll put in there, put a little water, and let it run at night. And once it, it runs out, it just automatically shuts off. Um, it gets sore sometimes. I, have to, I got some roller balls that, that, I, that I put on my muscles and stuff and climbing up and down ladders and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, Digize always. I've got some is another one if he stomach upset. Um, there's also some um, supplements that we can keep with for you. Um, I do the Ninja Red every day. 
uh, I have little p packages that I carry in my little cooler in between. This is what he has. And then I have, sorry, I have, we have the bottle in the fridge. So this is two ounces. You can take half of it or you take a whole one. I take a whole one. Yep. Um, tastes really good. It is immune support like you wouldn't believe. Both of us have been um, blessed with um, vision. And they can't say that. Some people have energy when they take it. I don't know that. No. I think my biggest problem is, is I like a little, I like, I like chips and fries and stuff, and that kind of, the grease kind of slows me down. Um, the nitro is like, I think it's like a, a five-hour energy drink. I, I've drank them before, the five-hour energy. Um, the, the nitro, I'll actually do a couple of them in a row just for energy if I'm getting kind of tired in the mm -hmm. afternoon and stuff driving. And... and um, it uh, really does well. I that's um, I hit a lot of that. Um, I'm kind of a sweet tooth. I like little mini donuts and stuff, which is really not healthy. And right now I'm I'm using the the, the bars my wife got for me, and um, they're really it it takes care of my sweet tooth. Here's one of them. And I actually use it for a, a, a supplement of, of having something to eat or whatever. Because I'm, like I said, I'm, I'm on the road all day, 700 miles. And, and so I, I really try to watch and I don't stop very often and stuff. So them kind of snacks are a lot better than some of my other choices I've ever had. Um, I'm trying to get him going on the zings. These are carbonated, and I've got some I'm going to send him with this next trip, so to avoid that pop. That yeah, I'm not that? much of a pop drinker, but I will sometimes get goofy and do a, a monster drink and stuff, and it's really hard on my stomach um, and my kidneys. I uh, This stuff here does not, I don't know if it's because it doesn't have as much sugar or if it's all what's in it. Um, I've really never looked that close, but I don't have the side effects as I do with uh, with the monster drinks. Or I can't drink much pop. My kidneys, um, it, I, I start getting a backache driving truck. Um, like I said, I, I eat a lot of different stuff on the road that, that affects my stomach. Um, so I do the, uh, I put this in my water. What is it alkaline? Alkaline, yep, to help neutralize. That's a good one. That's that's really good for. I just uh, I carry bottled water with, and I'll just throw it in the water, and and drink it. Um, this is my second week of uh, probiotics, and that seems to be helping a lot with my stomach stomach issues with the way I eat and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, I've done the beard oil. Um, sometimes I'll I'll grow a little bit of everything on my face, and it really itches. And guys know how that itches. This stuff here actually will make me feel a lot better. On um, it won't make my skin my it, it keeps the skin more moisturized, and it won't itch as much. Mm -hmm. And to go to that part, um, we're um, I've had for years in uh, in the winter time. I, I love hot showers. I just I, I'll stand in there forever. Well, it dries my skin out, and uh, Diana's made me up some soaps, and it's actually it it moisturizes your skin and stuff. And this is the first winter I've never sat and scratched until I actually scratched till I bleed. Um, His legs. My legs. It just yeah. they just get so dried out and and itch and the truck stop soaps and stuff like that or you know it, it just dries your skin out They're harsh and I was able to just I use some oils in it and I used just this gentle base and then because he's busy and he's not going to take the time to put lotions on I just added a, a tablespoon of um, 
oops, here, I'll show a tablespoon of olive or um, almond oil to it, and I just put it in here. It doesn't lather as much. I mean, no. that's hard to get used to. Yeah. But it cleans, and it, it stays on your skin. Yeah, he Because after like, you get out of the shower, it's like you got grease, not grease on you for touch-wise, but you can tell your skin has got moisture in it. Mm -hmm. that it's so not. it's like you're busy, you don't have time to, you know, and then it's one more product, whereas yes. I can fine-tune this, or if, you know, in the summertime we can add, or whatever's going on, I can add purification or something like that. I can add an oil to fine-tune it. They also have a, a one you can purchase, and I put it in just a about this much in a little pump bottle and that one foams a little more right so he uses both of them kind of nice um, and I'm not much of a, a gimmick person I, I'm, <laughs> she's, it's really hard for me to try stuff yeah um, but the stuff I have tried really works well and I'm not a salesman to, to go out and tell people that you know you need to use this or whatever um, I just kind of try things um, and explain because there's other drivers out there that have a lot of the same symptoms of I do for um, for breathing wise and stuff and um, I don't like to get pushy and, no, we don't want to. and I'm not a you know I'm not a doctor but I just know what's been working for me and and to stay healthy and that's because I was off work for six weeks and very, I I was really sick, and and the doctors didn't even couldn't. They just want to keep giving you pills, and um, I just don't want to go that. I'm not a pill person. I have a really hard time taking pills. Um, just, I just, I'm not just that way. I just don't like taking. I don't like to take any other. I don't even like to take ibuprofen and stuff. If I don't have to take anything, I don't take anything. Mm -hmm. Um, she just brought out the toothpaste, which is really good toothpaste. Um, it's just a couple. They have different kinds. Can you share that recipe for the body wash later? Yes, I can. Um, the the toothpaste is excellent. Um, it it just uh, I've tried different a uh, lot of different toothpaste, and uh, some of it just leaves a taste in your mouth that it's a. <laughs> I haul, like I said, I haul chemicals, I haul loads of formaldehyde, uh, and I haul a lot of stuff that people don't really, uh, really know that what's in their food and stuff, and um, it'd be, it's amazing what, what the people put in, uh, in foods. Does so. doing two, Dory wants to know, does doing, by the way, hi Dory, does doing two nitros make you jittery? No. No. But I'm a pretty big guy. Well, um, but we know someone. I know someone. I think Dory, you've seen her. Stacy Teagues does two every morning before she gets out of bed. So. Yeah. No, it it doesn't do um, where. I've, I actually did. I was moving my daughter one time and um, was really dumb. She was on the third floor. I drank two monster drinks before I went and did it, <laughs> and it actually cramped my legs up where I couldn't even walk up steps. So. Just the the damage that that kind of stuff that you put in your body that right. is not really healthy it, for you. And we're just trying to make sure that because of the cho the choices that life that you can't change, we just want to make sure you have some positive ones. Right to, so, to grab and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, the oils, you know, especially after he's been exposed to some nasty stuff at some of the places. Um, uh, this is a thieves spray, and I'm gonna modify. Hi, Don. I'm going to modify it. He wants one that he can spray in his mouth, and you can't because this has got denatured alcohol, and so he can't ingest this. So I'm going to make him up something. Um, we need something that's so won't <coughs> freeze, and you can't in the truck have, like, um, vodka because <laughs> we're probably getting into trouble. So I'm looking and researching that. Another thing, too, is, is I'm going to send him some... Um, hand sanitizer but you can just take the thieves I mean what we're trying to do is get rid of the chemicals and keep healthy I send him um, dishes with a uh, food and he keeps it in his freezer and when they come home they're pretty nasty I mean they he wipes them out and stuff so I just take my thieves cleaner and lay them in the sink for a little bit spritz them and let them sit and then just give them a scrub and put them in the dishwasher and I feel like they have really gotten gotten really clean so we mm -hmm. just keep it 
keep it good. But that works. That stuff works good for cleaning. Um, Sometimes um, from driving truck, sitting so long, um, I have some knee issues. Um, they start to ache after a while because of circulation. Mm -hmm. And um, I'll, I'll I'll just admit I don't take them unless I I start having a lot of issues. I think that's okay though. Um, cause I, I, I kind of bounce around. I'll try, um, once I, once the aching goes away, I quit taking them. And that was, that was the Agilis. That, that oh, one. Yep. Yeah. The Agilis. Yeah. Yep. This is a supplement that both of us, I, you know, we're hot and cold. When, when our knees are starting to ache, well, you take these a few times and they're good. The Power Dice is one that you can, um, it's started for guys. But women can take one, and that one's one if you're working out and stuff to help with recovery, a quicker recovery, and to make your, um, make your whatever you're going to do, it gives you the energy you need. So it helps you um, be a little bit quicker, stronger when you do it. And we don't do that one all the time either. No. So just something to do. But I think um, Dr. Ollie, someone I've seen before, talks about doing the peppermint before exercising. You can actually jump, they measure jumping higher. And yeah. going further along. Yeah, it, it, it opens all your passages. Yeah, I mean, it really opens, yeah. supports. Um, I do um, prostate yeah. uh, the, pills. It's called, and we don't have extra, it's called prostate health. It's um, um, it's kind of one that doesn't taste real well if, when you burp it. That's what I heard. Um, we'll have to look and see if there's some tricks to that. But um, I have... I have friends that are my age that have a lot of issues, and I don't. Um, my dad had issues, um, so I don't want to go that route because it's not pretty. I mean, it's it's right. uh, you're up all night, um, and um, surgery is not even a cure a lot of times to uh, to fix the problem. Right. So, and I, my but my dad is not a water drinker. I I. I have my coffee in the morning, and I I carry water all all day in a truck, and I drink water pretty much all day, and um, that that really helps to do that to, to keep. What do you put? It, what do I tell you to put in it? In your water. The lemon water. Yeah. It's um, I don't know if if some people have a um, I have an issue with uh, ice cream. <laughs> uh, it it. It'll make me cough. It it's it likes it leaves a film in my throat, and or if I wake up and I have a a, a, a film in my throat, I um I put a couple drops of a lemon in my water, and well you you if you've been to a restaurant and you order water and you have a slice of lemon in it, um, it's very good for you. Plus it it actually cleans your palate and cleans your throat out and. I've had really good luck with that mm -hmm. um, to knock down my coughing and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Dory said, "So overall, have you been have you seen some improvements in your life from the using the In Living products?" Oh, very much. I mean, like I said, I've been around a lot of sick people. Um, I was with a gentleman uh, three weeks ago. He um, he wanted some help in his semi on his phone to get an app put on. Um, I helped him put an app on his phone. We got up the next morning. We were both going to the same place. Um, next thing we know, I, we had to stop a couple times. I said, what's going on? And he was throwing up. And he had called home, and his wife and his grandkids all had the flu. And I never got it. I mean, I was with his phone. I was in his truck. Mm -hmm. um, like I said, I couldn't, I was worried I was going to get it. I felt like I was going to get it, and I I really stuck to my guns with my thieves and stuff. And, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, like I said, I, like, I'm around it all the time. It's like being at a hospital where you're a lot of sick people, where you're in truck stops, you're grabbing handles, you're grabbing stuff all the time. So... Um, I try to keep some things in there that'll help if he's not going to, you know, if he's going to be there and not feeling well, you've got to have some things to try to help support, you know. And you need, you need support from somebody that really knows the oil. Um, cause I'll call, I'll call her and ask, 
I got this problem, this is itching or this is hurting. What can I use? Because I actually have a little kit in the truck that pretty much has everything I need um, for stuff like that. And um, not saying sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but right. 90, most of the time it works. It definitely I, is going to help support whatever else you need. Right. You know, sometimes if you're not feeling well and you can't, if the oils aren't helping, you got to take something. Right. Or you got to go to the doctor. I mean, we're not we're not saying that. But again, if you can do something ahead of time or something along with, you know, if you're on some pain pills and stuff, if the oils will help, if nothing else, something for calming or relaxing or stuff. Right. So, yeah. do you think there's anything else? Oh. But, do we take something every morning? Um, you do the ninja? ninja. Every morning. Um, thieves every morning. Yeah, thieves every morning. Um, Life 9 every night, the probiotic. Take a probiotic. Even if you don't take this one, take a probiotic. It really helps your digestive system. Um, some of your, um, when do you take your, um, the prostate you take? In the morning. morning. We've yeah. got a inner defense he takes if it, oh, I say sometimes switch up the thieves or add it. This is just a supplement with with oils besides other things that help you. And then Super B. Super B, that's right. He does take Super Bs. Yep. They give you a lot of energy. So those are a good one. Um, but, yeah, Ninja Red every day. Tastes decent. Ask Waylon, you know, Don. Remember Waylon? That's, I mean, he drink five, six ounces a day. So um, when we went on the cruise, there was six of us that went. Five of us did the Ninja most days. Um, what, the one that didn't got the flu for a week, um, and one of the other ones, she just had a cold last week, but she was still doing the Ninja, but she's also got a new grandbaby that is being exposed to all kinds of things. So I don't know. I don't know. I mean, there were people mm -hmm. on us in masks. There was on the plane. It was a lot of people were sick. So, um, oh, Dory, thank you for showing, sharing the story with us. I hope a lot of other men will be open to this. Well, another thing we like to talk about is, you know, besides oils helping with immunities and supporting things, and um, there's some fun things with the, with the oils. I posted my, Dean's my Shootron man. This oil smells amazing. It's good for both girls and guys. This is, this is the PG part, and um, earmuffs for the kids, um, romance. There are oils that work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and here if this, um, there's one, I won't even say, this one just, it's called Goldenrod, don't need to say any more, um, we do classes, not him and I, I've done classes, <laughs> <laughs> not Dean and I, no, yeah. no, 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 no. Um, and then the other one, Idaho Blue Spruce, this is, I call this Mr. Romance, I just absolutely love this one, so oils can be fun too. Fragrances, yep. Yeah. yeah. Definitely smells. smells set in the mood, and even that stuff we buy that is in the used in the bedroom can be toxic. So you can make your own. Um, I think that's about it, isn't it? Unless anyone has any questions, or post them and we can answer them later. That would be great. Thanks, honey. You're He's a really good support. I mean, yeah, helping me with the, the dogs this morning and that kind of stuff, and it's just nice. I mean, he'll answer any questions. He he was a little kicking and screaming, but. He's definitely supported my journey on it, and it's just nice for him to have some options. So have a good day, everyone, and we'll talk to you later. Yep. Bye. Thanks. Oops. Now I can't get it to shut up.